Hi there, friends. I'm meteorologist Robert Spetta. High pressure continues to dominate a good portion of the western Pacific. We do have a weak tropical wave skirting its way by Mindanao, while another front moving its way across southeastern areas of China. It's part of the rainy season front that's setting up. That actually could bring a bit of a cool surge to Luzon, which may provide some relief. Uh, a little list here on our Wednesday, but um, yeah, just in general, the heat's going to continue. I'm going to talk more about this in a bit. La Nina not in place yet, but it is expected to. And the long range GFS is uh, getting a little bit um, interesting. We'll say that. Past week, though, temperatures in Manila have been on the hot side. Can't stress that enough. Up to near record breaking levels out here, all thanks to a high pressure ridge, which has been continuing to dominate. And although we did see our little front down towards the south, not front, but trough moving across Mindanao, uh, that's bringing some relief and some showers there. We're not getting it basically from Cebu North. Meanwhile, here's our little uh, kind of cool surge that's trying to set up. That could bring us some showers. Uh, the isolated parts across Cagayan, as mentioned here on our Tuesday. But let's talk about this little wave down towards the south, because that is bringing some rainfall across Mindanao, even heavy at times out here. Nothing terribly tropical or organized, but yeah, on and off showers. You can see where the total rainfall amounts for the Philippines as we go ahead through the week and are down here towards the south and a little bit across parts of Luzon, but not a lot. All right, let's look at our flyover. As I mentioned, Wednesday, get a little bit of those showers in Mindanao. So uh, overall dry out here into parts of the science even heading over towards uh pelawan you got some cloudy skies out there could even get a couple drops from this little tropical trough kicking on by and then back towards the north yeah for once a little bit of relief it's not gonna last long for parts of luzon still hot though look at this high 30s near 40 degrees across the kageon valley Ugh, absolutely torturously hot out there so manila you're still going to be in the mid to high 30s for your forecast uh we're taking a look out towards well how about this now that the computers froze shargao uh scattered showers from our passing little tropical trough there and then into cebu very similar friday over towards saturday heading into sunday all right i want to go back to this guys i want to show you the long range gfs so we got the near term kind of knocked out here in our forecast how about the long term mid um may gfs is keep on trying to pull for something now remember the long range is you have to um have initialization factors and we're not really quite seeing that here but yeah it, it's interesting in the sense that uh the gfs has been trying to pull something out there south of guam we haven't really had that for the past four months so now that we're seeing something you know, it's kind of, it, it raises eyebrows. Now, does that mean something's going to happen? No, but it does mean we could start to get closer to that season where do things, things do start to happen. And I'll leave you on this note. Uh, we are currently in Enso neutral. The uh, El Nino has ended. But the La Nina is expected to set up heading over towards August, September, October, which the rainfall anomaly, meaning the kind of above or below average here in blue indicating well above average rainfall is expected to take place later on this year meaning that uh yeah even though it's dry it's been hot lately uh things are going to change in the latter half of the year based on everything uh we have been seeing out here so i'm all over the place in this update but i hope you got some information out of it if you did Hit that like and subscribe button. Also check out our Patreon. Math, massive shout out to all our Patreon members. Um, I got some other educational videos coming out soon too. I uh, hope you guys like them. But uh, that's, that's all for today. A little, little, quick, little quick weather update in the office. All right. Have a great day, guys. <laughs> Bye.